there appears to be a tweet by the Ayatollah that seems to suggest that he is a third positionist. But I'm going to have to disagree. Now, Khomeini is talking specifically with regards to workers inside of um, an Islamic point of view. So this is going to be different than capitalism or communism. If he thinks that somehow the Islamic view on workers is going to outdo communism, well, I'm going to have to seriously disagree with him. But that, that's not necessarily what he's saying. See, the interesting thing here is that I Iran is capitalist. And you can't say that you have a outlook that values work and workers and then be capitalist. Well, those are two completely contradicting things. Sorry, that's just a complete nonsense. It's not necessarily clear exactly what he's trying to say here. The best that I could guess is that he's trying to say that Iran appreciates workers and that they have value and the work that they do has value. And I'm sure that he does. I'm sure that he does value it. I'm sure that Islam does value workers. I'm not denying that. But their system is capitalism in the end. And capitalism doesn't value workers. At best, what he's talking about is capitalism with the state, you know, coming in and regulating things and promising higher minimum wages and so capitalism with a human face. I don't think that you can necessarily do that and put the stamp of Islam on it. That would seem contradictory to me. This would almost seem to... Th th this suggests that socialism really would be the only way for Islam to carry out this value of work and workers. So, while I'm sure he, he definitely does feel that way, and I'm not saying that he doesn't, the current economic and political system of Iran does not match this value. If anything, Khomeini has essentially said that socialism is the way forward. That while he may say the disintegrated system of communism, would be, of course, it's important to note that communism has not yet been brought into existence, only socialism. So, he's not exactly knowing what he's talking about here, but this is a common mistake that a lot of people make. Because he's using socialism and communism interchangeably. So I would have to say that, in, in my response to the Ayatollah, if this is the way that you feel, and this is the, the, the direction that you feel Iran should take, you're going to have to find a new economic system to go with. Thank you for watching. If you like this program, then please head over to my Patreon page and set up a monthly donation. It's your donations that keep this program running. Also, if you would like, please rate, comment, subscribe, and share in various social media.